Well, fellas, I convinced Donna to break her celibacy vow, which in layman's terms means I'm a layman. <laughs> Damn, Foreman, got your girlfriend to have sex with you? What is your secret? Okay, you guys, it's a big deal. Have either of you ever slept with my girlfriend? <laughs> no, but I've done it with High's girlfriend. <laughs> And I was good. Well, just what the heck is this? What a great auction. Red had a few beers and bought a canoe. I bought a canoe. Who would have thought me and Red go out and he's the one to buy something stupid? I don't know where I'm going to put this. Red, why would you buy a canoe? I think the question is, why haven't I before? But we can't afford this. Sure we can. I used the money that you gave me yesterday. That was for Eric's wedding present. Congratulations, Eric. I knew you always wanted a canoe. Red, since you blew the money, I expect you to come up with a nice sentimental gift for Eric that doesn't cost anything. Well, that's what you get for going out and drinking. Maybe one day you'll learn to stay at home and drink like me. Hey, boys. I bought a canoe. <laughs> so, Mrs. Foreman told me to get this thing out of her sight. Now, that could mean put it in the garage, leave it out for the garbage man, I like to think it meant, hey, have a free canoe. <laughs> and the three of us with a canoe will be unstoppable. <laughs> what should we do with it? Let's see. What can we do with a canoe that would make people say, oh, no, what's wrong with them? <laughs> oh, no! I know what we could do today that's going to be really fun. Kelso, the last time you said that, we had to get your stomach pumped. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> hey, so, uh, how do you plan on steering this thing on land? <laughs> Duh. Kelso, I think you should wear a helmet just in case anything was wrong. Guys, I'm riding an open canoe down a rocky mountainside. What could possibly go wrong? I think I'm with Fez on this helmet thing. Ah, uh, no, I'm not falling for that one. <laughs> falling for what? The old helmet gag. Kelso, I just want you to protect your head from being crushed like a berry. Yeah, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Now, let go of the ropes and watch me fly! One, One two, two, three! Woo!